Hi, my name's Trev Hutchings, and this is how to make your song louder in BandLab. Today, I'm going to introduce you to a part of song recording that most of you have either never heard of or have heard of but don't really know what it is. Mastering. Now this is particularly important in BandLab because BandLab does not have a master track. So let's look at how to make the song as loud as possible in BandLab. Now the first thing is to download your song. So click on the three lines icon at the top left of the browser window. Click on Project on the pop-up menu. Click on Download on the pop-up menu. Then click on Mix Down As. Now click on the Download icon to the right of the Wave icon. Your song will be downloaded to your computer's download folder. Now click on the X icon to close the download window. Next, click on the three lines icon again. Click on Project on the pop-up menu. Then click on New Project. At the bottom left of the new track window, click on Import Audio MIDI. Click on your computer's download folder. Then double click on your song. Now just below the track name, click on Plus Effects. The Effects pane now opens at the bottom of the browser window. Next, click on Add Effect. Click on the Dynamics tab on the pop-up menu. Scroll down the list and click on Vintage Limiter. In this simple demonstration, we will deal with just two of the knob icons of the Vintage Limiter. The Gain knob icon and the Volume knob icon. If you move the mouse cursor over the volume knob icon, the word volume is replaced by a number. It currently says zero. Click on the number and type in minus 0.5. This will set the maximum volume to just below the point of digital clipping and stop the volume level overloading the output. Next, click on the play icon and watch the master volume output meter. Then move the mouse cursor over the gain knob icon. Press the left mouse button on the gain knob icon and move the mouse slowly up the screen until the two horizontal lines on the master volume output meter go almost 
all the way across the metre and are red. The vintage limiter volume setting will stop the lines going all the way across the meter and overload the output. Keep moving the mouse cursor up the screen until the lines are mostly going almost all the way across the screen, but not so far up the screen that you can hear any distortion in your music, or you can hear an audible reduction in the sound volume. shivers down my back I said baby what you doing here I finally at the bottom left of the browser window click on the effects effect tab to close the effects pane if you enjoyed this video do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button cheers